Hi Scorpio, your love and relationship tarot cards reading by Emma for the month of February 2022. Okay, we're going to have four cards representing your relationship. That's how we're going to start. So your relationship with Page of Wands. Two of Swords. The High Priestess. Nine of Cups, your influencing energy for your relationship. Two of Cups, another four cards, Scorpio, representing you, right? So, Page of Wands, and you with Judgment. Two of Swords with King of Wands, the High Priestess with Eight of Cups, Nine of Cups with Death. Page of Wands, your influencing energy. Another four cards now representing your partner. So, page of wands for your partner with six of cups, two of swords and your partner with seven of pentacles, king of cups and ace of swords influencing energy the world. Look, a lovely two of cups, two people uh, beginning new lovely relationship, lovely, harmonious, balanced energy, youngish one, meaning very beginning. We can talk very beginning of the relationship. Be a relationship began somewhat earlier on, maybe last month, maybe in December, but this is very beginning, still making it, still progressing into a relationship, but all good, all fine, all lovely with two of cups. Your partner perhaps needed to, I don't know, complete some period, okay, some, maybe they have also relationship earlier on, maybe job, career, or, you know, something was there in the life of uh, that person, that side, that, uh, I don't know, supposed to first finish before this relationship with you resumes. You felt that you are onto new territory, uh, this is new relationship for you, you believed, you were enthusiastic about this relationship. Everything talks about new relationship. You and another one, relationship begins fantastic, okay? You were over the moon with this page of wands. Your partner perhaps needed first to deal with something before this relationship really starts. Now look, page wants this is relationship this is new territory you people are together and you know from now on you will just just to see to get to know each other to get to used to each other to get into your routine you see what I'm saying relationship to carry on you know with its own life for now it's just that new territory you people together in the new relationship and you're loving it a very happy energy with the page of wands your partner with six of cups childlike energy believing in you in this relationship beautiful energy is coming from the very pleasant very fine very candid energy comes from your partner you are though with the judgment it seems to me you are seeing I believe relationship that's supposed to last that is meant to be for you now being that we do have judgment that always sits on something from the past something that resurrects now and there's six of cups gain something from your past. We can maybe talk, Scorpio, about person from your past that comes back now. Maybe you didn't have a relationship earlier on. It was just a person that you know from earlier on, but could also be, as I said, past relationship that comes back, revisits your life. It becomes alive again for both of you. Or you were just a friends earlier on, or you just knew each other in your childhood. You see what I'm saying? You people know each other from your past. This is something that resurrects, comes back. Uh, in a good way, very optimistic, new territory for you. You people are enthusiastic, you are loving it. The relationship is beginning, okay, that's for sure, and does have a big promise, okay, about the future for both of you. Now, look, Two of Swords is in decisive energy. Second week of February, a bit tricky, you are with King of Wands, your partner with Seven of Pentacles. You people do have some ideas about yourselves. 
okay or and perhaps uh, ideas about relationship could also be something like that but i kind of felt that it is about you personally this king of wands is your idea about your life what do you want of your life what do you want of your relationship or what your relationship is supposed to look like there's your idea nothing wrong with this idea this is exciting ideas okay with king of wands you do have in your mind that you and your partner are supposed to go out you're supposed to have exciting time. You're supposed to maybe ride the bikes, do some sport together, go and have a social life, vibrant social life. In that sense, King of Wands, that's how you approach your life and that what you per perhaps expect from your partner as well for you too to have that sort of life together. You see what I'm saying? Now, your partner with seven of pentacles, now that's something else. That is something already made, something that is already given, something that is already, your partner doesn't want to change much. Okay, it is what it is. I mean, and your partner is just looking into, you know, will it grow or it's going to be failure? You know, doesn't, is not ready for changes here. Seven of pentacles doesn't change much. That is ready-made situation. That is formed person already personality character formed already and very rigid this energy doesn't want to change it's just waiting to see you like me like this or you don't like me like this it's win and growth or it is failure in that sense energy out there it doesn't kind of compromise this seven of pentacles and the relationship is at standstill okay with two of swords kind of you people are in I don't know in two different spectrums, energetic spectrum, if I can say like that. You see, um, you or with this exciting energy, you would like to do things. You want your social life and you want to change this. You want, you're ready for changes, for, just, just for exciting life. You want to change this. Doesn't matter, change is fine as long as, long as it is all exciting and, and suits you both in that sense. But your partner is, I, I believe, a bit... Uh, more on a standstill, they, I mean, a bit more rigid that side, if I can put it that way, but it doesn't, your partner wouldn't change anything out there. Um, it seems to me your partner doesn't want to change much in their life in order to accommodate relationship or something. There's no movement. Your partner doesn't want to move in any sort of way. Another card, number to the high priestess again very secretive card it seems to me relationship is possible okay but you people have to agree have to get to know each other have to put things together and open okay this is secretive energy if you really want relationship to begin to exist you people have to open up have to accept this relationship as existing relationship that something is there you have to acknowledge it in that sense and then relationship is possible or art and then you can be, feel like a part of it in that sense for now everything is kind of yeah maybe everything is just maybe maybe now you want to leave behind some sort of situation, something that was very unhappy, very unfulfilling earlier for you. Your partner with King of Cups, your partner is quite all right that side. Your partner brings an offer, um, brings this emotional stability. Perhaps these ideas about how this relationship is supposed to operate will come now from your partner, okay? It's not exciting ideas. It's, it's more emotional, kind of let's cool it down. Let's see where we stay. Then we can start from the beginning. We don't need to go at all exciting all so much. I really believe that ideas that are coming from your partner are much calmer, more emotional. Okay, let's wait and see. Let's just be together and get to know each other slowly but surely. I really believe this energy is together, comes from your partner. They are bringing that sort of vibe. And you will, I really believe you will accept it, okay? Because you are expecting that it should bring a bit happier times for you. You tried something that is exciting, passionate, but it didn't work. Obviously, it didn't work. You have to abandon that kind of idea. But now something which is more, let's get to know each other slowly but surely. Stabilize your emotions and then we'll see what is going to happen in that sense this third week of um, February 
totally leaving behind something that was, something you will abandon, some ideas, some life that you used to have, you will abandon. Look, this Nine of Cups talks about emotional fulfillment. You people being together in the way you wanted it. Okay, this is your wish card. Just what you wanted for now. A lot of physical contact, physical satisfaction. Okay, so in that sense, I really believe this relationship works for you. Okay, for both of you, your partner with Ace of Swords. I mean, there is thoughts, there is clarity on your partner's side. And I really believe that now ideas are coming from your partner. This relationship does have an opening. But you will have to abandon somehow that, I don't know, you did have your ideas about the relationship, you, about something that you did have in your mind. Whether that is your idea about this person, okay, about your partner, current partner, or it's something from your past earlier on that you have to abandon. I don't know, you have to leave behind and abandon totally something that you did have in your life, okay? It's over, it's finished, you are leaving it behind. Very much present the whole half, second half of this month. It's so dominant, that energy is very dominant with you, that you are leaving behind something that you want to create for yourself, okay, to give space to something else, to ideas that are coming from your partner, I believe, because those ideas are better, they work better for both of you, work better for, for the relationship in general. I really felt that this is relationship in the making and it started earlier on. Both of you are not giving up, but the whole this month of February is now carry on, try to stabilize this this relationship. Relationship is at the very beginning and you are working on stabilizing it, okay, on getting to know each other, which way this relationship can work. Can it work anyhow? You see what I'm saying? You are bringing ideas. Your partner is bringing some ideas. I mean, it is a bit of a push and pull and it is a new relationship. A new people trying to somehow work it out, somehow to stabilize. I mean, when I say new relationship, I don't mean that you people didn't know each other early on. At contrary, it seems to me that you people, perhaps you were friends early on and could that could very well be a little bit of a problem. You know, what you people did have as a friends, okay, and what you people are having now as a couple. You know, there is a difference and there is change. In, in that sense, you're supposed to work out, okay, you are people undergoing some sort of changes in your relationship, transitioning yourself from friendship into uh, love relationship. You see what I'm saying? Could very well be something like that because I feel that you people knew each other from earlier on, but relationship, love relationship is forming. It started earlier on and it's still push and pull the whole this February. But anyway, it could bring some excitement, <laughs> so you enjoy it. Now, if you want your private reading, one like this one that you saw just now, go to my description box below. Click on the Fiverr link and um, that will take you through your order. 